going on everybody it's me jot the lee how y'all be today i am playing another episode of scrap mechanic and today i am going to be starting a scrap mechanic series called jot's military and you will see why in a minute but before we get completely into the video i want to make sure that you all Leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications to be notified every time I upload. And leave a friendly comment in the comment section down below. And check out my social medias in the description. I have Facebook, Discord, and Twitter on there. Now let's get into the video, shall we? But first, let's get rid of this. And, gee, you like my logo? I like it. My nice logo. Made it myself. It's a shield. The shield of a knight. For that's who I am. I am Lord Jot. Okay. But now to get rid of this. I am going to delete it. Yes. And then we will go over here. And I will show you why I want to start a military base. Well, military base series. Okay, put this down, and I will spawn in the reason why. Ta-da! Hear the big old clunk? This is a big old troop car crawler, and I made it myself. And I think I did pretty great on it. It's got lights, it's got spud gun cannons on it. Sentry guns, as I call them. And it's got a couple of nice doors. It's got one door there. It's got the one in the back. With the seats, as you can see. Then it's got the one here in the front. On the other side. It's pretty nice. You can pretty much get, it, get all around in here as long as you crouch crouch and you can go in and just like that and you can come in here see all the work or route that I did but this right here I was kind of bored the other day and I was just fiddling around with what I could build and I figured hey why not build one of these I mean I really wasn't sure that it was going to be this when I first started but that's what it came out to be So this right here is the driver's seat. If I zoom all the way out. I want to zoom in first. With one, I open up the flaps. Or the window guards, as you can call them. Bulletproof window guards. Because the spud guns can't hit break the windows when it's like that. Or like this, because they are there blocking. Now you can see out of it. Now you can't. Same goes with the top. You see out the top? Let light in. Now you can't. And you got the back ones as well, which is right here on number three. You have that side that opens up, and that side that opens up. It's all pretty cool. I seem to like it. And then you can drive it around, you know, just drive it and it works pretty good but you kinda have to have a running start to go up the ramps that's how heavy it is but then you also got number four which are the lights and then you got five and six which are the blinkers I just added on those on there because you got seven and eight, which are the two cannons which just shoot up for no apparent reason. And you got nine, which you can't see it from here, but are the lights on the inside. See, you might be able to see it from there. See in there, 
right there you can see the lights <coughs> flash on and off on and off on and off and then with number zero is the horn honk honk and that's pretty much it this is the inside of it but this kind of inspired me while I was building it to maybe make a whole series about it based around this thing which actually ain't too bad a vehicle modded wheels and all that but yeah I think it, it looks pretty good so <clears throat> that was pretty much my idea So that's what I'm going to do. And for my first project, I was thinking about maybe building something else. Because I like the troop crawler, but my color scheme is a bit different than what I've actually put on it. Put it on there because that's the camo troop crawler. I could make it a duplicate copy and make it in my color scheme because my color scheme would be blue black and gold and well gold as you know is not very good for camouflage but black and blue yeah sure but first before I start building I actually gotta find a nice spot to build because well it's kind of not really you can't really see a whole bunch of good stuff over here how about right here this right here seems like a nice area just a random spot and if you were wondering why I had a hole well in the roof that that's why because uh, I kind of you can't get in and out of it easily let's just put it that way Now then, how about right here? I will start building something. Hmm, take inspiration from something. How about this? The first episode, I will make a tank. Not just any old tank. A big tank.
internet kept cut to cutting out on me a little bit here and there, so I had to keep keep logging back in. But I got it done. The tank, Jut's armor tank. <laughs> But, yeah, I think it looks pretty good. Turned out great. Drive it forward, you can drive it back, and you can turn it around this way. You can almost spin it right in one spot, but it can't. It's not a completely zero turn, but it can just about do it. But yeah, this is my tank. And go left and right. And go up and down. I got fives in my horn. Then I can shoot myself with the cannon. But I think it turned out pretty good. Could have been better, but but I'd take it as it comes, I guess. And it didn't turn out too bad to me. Do a little few touch-ups here and there, and I think I will call this done. But yeah, this is what I'm going to be doing. Starting a series on creating military vehicles, and I might even make me a base, like on top of one of those things. The long ramp that I will most likely build off camera all the way down to the bottom. But yeah, I think it pretty good. But anyways. If you have any ideas for any me any more things I can create for my scrap mechanic world for Jot's, Jot's military base JMB as you can call it just put them down in the comment sections down below and also See if you can put me creations in there. Just put them. Just put them in for Jot's World. Name them jo for for Jot's World or for Jot's J M B. But I will find them few nice creations and I will show them and I will give you a shout out. But aside from that, I guess this has pretty much been the video. Me building my tank, making it look nice and everything. And well, next episode I will actually go on a tour of this little place because this is where I'm going to do it. And I will let you help me pick out locations of where to do it. Big mountain here, that big mountain there, or over there on that mountain thing. Anywhere will be work, work for making the headquarter, base headquarters. But the whole world is going to be the base. So I think it'll look pretty good. But anyways, Thanks for watching everybody and I will see you all next time in another scrap mechanic video or Minecraft video or whatever other kind of video I do on my channel. And hopefully Fortnite videos will be coming soon. But until then make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications, and leave a like and, and leave a friendly comment in the comment section down below. And subscribe to my, well follow me on Twitter. 
And check out my other social media, such as Discord and Facebook, in the description down below. This has been Jot D. Lee, and I hope to see you all next time. Goodbye! <laughs>